as part of our overall evaluation of every car we test, we include a test of how the headlights perform, how well you're going to be able to see at night. We come back here after hours, and not only does it give you an assessment of that particular car, but it lets us compare technologies. Are halogens better than HIDs? Are HIDs better than LEDs? It helps you make those decisions when you're presented with those options. But one thing we pretty much universally know is that regardless of the headlight type, they probably, even the best ones, don't give you enough time to see, react, and brake for objects ahead of you. Each year, cars hit and kill more than 4,000 pedestrians, and tens of thousands more are injured. Not surprisingly, most of these incidents happen at night. Now, car manufacturers like BMW and other luxury brands are making advancements in technology that will allow your car to see what your eyes cannot. For example, the night vision system on this new BMW 7 Series can detect the thermal image of people or animals at night, and even through smoke or fog during daylight hours. If the system senses a pedestrian or animal is headed toward your lane, it can also alert you with both visual and audible warnings in the dash or on the heads-up display. This works very well on poorly lit roads or anywhere that people or animals might be close to the road. Still newer technologies take this concept one step further. BMW's dynamic light spot systems, for example, will not only detect a pedestrian or larger animal, but will also illuminate them with a spotlight-like beam that makes the driver even more aware of the potential hazard. This can not only let the driver see what they might not be able to, but it also potentially alerts the pedestrian as well. We found the spotlights at times illuminated pedestrians that we hadn't even seen yet. Unfortunately, Aspects of the current vehicle lighting regulations in the U.S. prohibit some of these features. Limits to how bright a light can be and whether lights can turn on and off other than for emergency vehicles may mean that some changes in those standards need to happen before we see this on U.S. vehicles. So what some of these new technologies show, be it night vision or pedestrian detection, is they all are an advantage in seeing at night, which is a safety plus. So we at Consumer Reports will not only work to help the regulations open up to allow these technologies, but we'll continue to evaluate them in every car we test.